What's up everybody? This is the fourth part of how to have the best year of your life in 2016. Check it out. I just got done watching this video. This is by Dr. Mike Mew. And I'm going to go ahead. You guys check this video out on your own. It's a long lecture by a very smart dentist. Um, I'm going to sum up a few parts that were very fascinating to me. This is all about how to have a better jaw. Okay, I'll leave a description in the link below. Now, the old wives tale about stand up straight, you know, chest up, keep your mouth closed and stand up straight. He said is not far from the truth because that's a very simple way to look at it. Stand up straight, keep your mouth shut because the posture there is correct, right? He says that when you keep your lips together, when you keep the tongue on the roof of your mouth and the teeth resting on one another, that is the correct posture. And that if you have that, you most likely have a prominent and strong jaw that, um, yeah, <laughs> that is pronounced. So your default setting, guys, check this now. How, try that. Just let your, your face rest. I myself, my lips are together, my tongue is pushed against the roof of my mouth, but my teeth have this slight spacing between. So he said, if you can learn to program your brain so that this is your default uh, setting where the teeth are together, the tongue is holding it up and the lips are together. He gave an example, the way you can look at the teeth and the tongue kind of going against each other, we haven't really learned to do that. He said. It's kind of like how the hamstrings help you balance and the, the quads, right? There's this like balancing act going on. We don't just put all the stress in the front and then fall forward. We kind of bounce all the time. He said we have to program, program, program our brains to do the same with our teeth in our mouth. So teeth together, not clenching down, just resting on top of one another. And then the tongue kind of holding it there, lifts together. Stand tall, keep your mouth shut. And he also said one way that we can strengthen it. And he said, chewing gum is excellent. He said, the only problem is gum isn't hard enough. We tried to develop a uh, harder gum, but it costed a boatload of money, so we didn't do it. And anyways, he said, chewing gum, chewing hard foods, beef jerky, uh, meat, you know, I don't know, vegetables, hard vegetables, that all helps to strengthen the jaw. And we've all seen a lot of mouth breathers, right? Maybe you are a mouth breather, that's okay, let's fix it, okay? Don't get discouraged, let's fix it. By bringing that up, by teaching yourself the correct default setting. I ask that you guys wouldn't just take my word, okay? But you would look into this video. It's very fascinating and there's a lot to learn. There's a lot of um, just, just understanding to the problems that we may be dealing with when it comes to having a poor jaw line or uh, yeah, structure, structure. So I'm, I'm uh, thinking of other stuff that I want to point out. You know, lowering your body fat and just having a good posture man, is going to help so much. The skin on your face, the foods you eat, take that into consideration. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will see you soon.